So we have a question here, not a question, it's from an undercard person called Billy Gates. Billy says, I honestly, this is in reference to my pizza video, vegan pizza at Domino's Australia. I honestly don't think he knows what he's talking about anymore with this, that he is, he, that or he is looking for attention backlash. Places like Domino's and KFC are part of the problem. Taking money from people who try to do the right thing. If you want to eat that shit that is bad for you, then go ahead, Harley. But there are other people who are out here for real nutrition and real food. Okay, let's, let's okay. So, places like Domino's are part of the problem. Taking money from people who try to do the right thing. Okay, so the tomato grower who grows the tomatoes for tomato sauce, local here in South Australia, and the wheat farmer who grows the wheat here, local in South Australia, are they doing the wrong thing by growing plant foods for us vegans to eat? According to this fuckwit, undercard fuckwit, this person probably been vegan. This person probably been fucking probably even a vegan. And they may have been vegan for like a millisecond. They're like, oh, 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 oh. I can override during riders 15 years over 400,000 kilometers ridden as a vegan. With a little, fa- a little YouTube comment, bro, you can't. Um, so we should not support farmers who grow vegan foods because Domino's sell it. Like, you're a fucking idiot, bro. And that's why no one watches your videos. That's why no one stops you in the street. I got stopped maybe 30 times today for selfies. You know, like, literally, turn it on time. Is awesome and people can do vegan because my prescription carbon the fuck up anyone can do nobody just wants to eat fucking bananas for dinner nobody just wants to eat potatoes for dinner all right you can't perform just eating bananas or just eating potatoes at like a really your best level you can't you know i know because i've tried to do it you can't you need refined carbohydrates like flour your flour is refined sugar refined carbohydrate processed food you need processed food you know Everybody who does a potato diet or just a banana diet, their mileage for the fitness level drops. If you're a cyclist, you go on Strava, they're, doing, they're, they're absent. They're not there. Um, same with my fitness. My fitness level drop when I try to do just whole foods. So you just can't do it and really be fucking, fucking smashing it. You can't. You, know, you can't. You need dried fruit, and that's not a whole food. It's processed, refined sugar. And if you want, if you want to go next level, you have to add in the refined carbohydrate. Plus the, the dried fruit, the refined sugars, the refined flours, the breads, the pizzas, the rices, white rice, stuff like that. Refined carbohydrate, you need it for your best weight loss result. So you can train harder, be harder, be a better person. Anyway, so this, this person's talking, just dropping little sound bites here. Real, new, real nutrition, real food. What is that, bro? You don't define that. In my opinion, a fucking tomato, a fucking vegan pizza is real motherfucking food. It's got vitamins, nutrients in there. It keeps you carved up. It's good, bro. I could work harder than you can any day of the week, bro. Any day of the week. I'll fucking work you under the table, bro. On my fucking... On my, my prescription. And then he says... um, He says that Domino's... Char- Domino's is part of the world hunger problem. I'm not sure if this person is trolling. Domino's charges through the roof for ch- basic cheap ingredients. A Domino's pizza in Australia. A large fucking veg trio. No cheese. Spicy veg trio. costs five bucks. This person says, why aren't you supporting local cafes that make vegan meals or something? I'll go to a local cafe and say, I want a vegan pizza. Large. They're like, no worries, mate. 20, 30, 40 bucks. Some places charge $40 for a vegan pizza in Australia. So this moron are the same basic cheap ingredients that Domino's use. So this moron out there is just talking, just verbal diarrhea. And it's people like you, bro, who don't make anyone go vegan or inspire anyone to go vegan actually not, not to go vegan to stay vegan because anyone can watch a you know something and go I'm going to go vegan but then after a week they're fucking hungry because they don't know what to eat and they're like oh I just, I'm going to eat potatoes or I can just eat bananas and I, I'm just starving I'm fucking fuck this this is too hard it's too hard so my prescription is sustainable mate give me any motherfucker out there and they can go vegan follow my advice can't they and the reason why I fine-tuned it in here in 2017, 2016, 2015, 2011, 2012, 2013, 2014 to incorporate more starches, etc. Just give people backup plans or it could be a primary plan. You know, if you prefer eating starch all day, then do that. For me, I, I can't do starch all day. I need my fucking simple sugars, my fruits. I always got to start a day with something sweet and juicy. Even when I'm eating starch, lunchtime, cereal, I'll make it lots of water, lots of sugar in there. Simple sugar dominant. And that's uh, that's these people. They're, they're the people who, uh, you know, who don't do enough of veganism. I mean, like vegan gains, even you know, and and vegan cheater and all those people. Like, what program do they give to people? You know, and again, not casting shade or putting anyone down. Just saying, like, you know, all these people fucking 
happy, healthy, vegan, all, all these people that basically I got onto YouTube in the first place and then they turn around and sort of throw shade a bit here and there. Again, not, not bad people, just whatevs, but what advice do they have? You know, what advice do they have? Like, what, like <laughs> often people's egos are so far up their ass. They're like, oh, I like Duran Rider. Oh, now, no, nah, Duran Rider's competition now. Now I can't promote what he promotes. What do you promote? What do you stand for, people? Not just these three people I mentioned, but like, in general, the people, the haters or whatever, like, give us some fucking objective fucking advice to follow. But you don't. You're just little sound bites. And then people say, I don't, I don't eat refined processed carbohydrates. And then they're fucking eating it in their videos. It's like, <laughs> you know, like, fuck. Noobs. Everyone, everyone's a noob at the start. Everyone makes mistakes. Just call yourself out if you do. And be objective. If you're going to critique, you need to be objective. What does objective mean? Objective and subjective. Subjective is, it's hot outside today here in Australia. It's hot outside here in Australia. That's subjective. Objective is, it's 30, 36 degrees Celsius. The time is 3.29. And I'm in Adelaide, South Australia. And it's 36 degrees Celsius. It's very hot today. That's objective. Please be objective. If you're going to give criticism, constructive criticism is always welcome on my channel, on my social media. But let's please be objective versus subjective dribble because you're jealous, confused, ignorant, apathetic, or all of the above. Thanks for watching.